Hey, welcome back to Off The Grid with Bert. Well, we've just had a delivery from China today. Uh, we've just had a STW 133-2P waste oil burner arrive. Took five days to get here, which is pretty freaking amazing. Uh, now this is for a customer, this one. Um, and as we get the job done, we'll sort of show you the installation and whatnot. And anyway, this is how they come. They come well packaged in a in a solid box. Can get the other side of it off. That is. Let's see. Yeah, as I said, it's well packaged. Extremely well packaged. Okay. So we open up the box. We're faced with a transfer pump, burner snout itself. You lift this panel out here. You can see the burner itself. Well packaged in plastic with the heating tank. Um, now this model has a built-in air pump now it's not currently on the end of the burner where it would otherwise mount, so I'm tipping it's in one of these boxes down under the bottom here somewhere. Um, but yeah, what we'll be doing is we'll we'll get this thing out and we'll give it our pre-delivery inspection to make sure all the wiring is up to Australian standards. Um, generally, it is on these burners, although we did have one that had an undersized neutral wire at one at one point, which um, was resulting in overheating of the terminal block. So we had to um, rectify that, but um, yeah. Well, this is how your Bay Run burners arrive. So um, certainly well packaged. Um, yeah. They're using a, um, not using the Dan Foss controller on these anymore, because apparently they reckon they can't get them. Probably something to do with the worldwide shipping issues we're all facing, but it's a dual nozzle burner. Let's see if you can see the two nozzles in there. Oh, move my finger. Right. So it's going to be really interesting to see how this one goes because, um, as far as I know, I have not seen one of these larger burners um, with the built-in air pump. And there's our details. So it can go between 70 and 115 kilowatts on the heating side of things. Pretty good. All right, no worries. We'll catch you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, oh, and by the way, we're looking to become an agent for Bay Run here in Australia, so um, we'll see how that all get, all that pans out. Um, because, yeah, this is, with gas prices the way they are now in Australia, this kind of thing is going to be in hot demand, hopefully, especially with uh, people who've got a plentiful supply of waste oil. Um, all right, we'll catch you in the next video. Cheers.